Good morning. Happy Wednesday. I think selling time should be upon us. It's not like I've never sold bows before, right? Got trapped into the sinking. I'm going to wait until I have everything. All the T's crossed and the I's dotted. My website is up, but why? So I'm going to do kind of a soft opening here. The 3rd, August 3rd, Saturday, Saturday, Saturday. I'm going to be offering not a complete line of everything, but all seven of my bow styles, various forms. This one, for example, you can either get the blocked out or you can get it rounded and shaped and back it yourself. The horse bow. Again, August 3rd, Saturday, Saturday. Either the blank or a little extra rounded or three steam bent ready for sinew backing. Um, same with my paddle bow. You know, you've seen it before. This one's shaped. Get it blocked out and shape it yourself or get that for an extra cost. And I could run through all seven. And it'll probably favor you. How I'm going to work it is that I'm going to have, on Saturday, I'm committing to this. I'm going to go through each one of them. So you can see it. And hopefully there's no reason why I can't have, like, a my talisman, too. That's number seven. I still have to do that. Bow per bow per bow per bow. And then you go down into the description, and it'll show... The cost for each bow in each version that I will be turning out. As of yet, if you haven't been watching me forever, you probably have not seen like a finished talisman that I ordered or 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 sold or one of the snake bows with the cloth snakeskin backing. But you can you can dig through the archives and look for each one of these styles and you will see finished ones that I have sold. Yep, Saturday. August 3rd, I'm going to start selling. And again, it's probably going to favor you because I haven't, I'm going to estimate shipping and it's going to probably favor you. Um, the prices will be a little less. Now, a note. I do want to, <clears throat> horse bowl, for example, it kind of goes along with all of them. It's horse bowl. Get a bending form with it. You can get the sinew, which I should have a lot of sinew. By Saturday, it was mailed out mo yesterday, Monday, and hide glue. You know the complete, the complete. This is one-stop shopping for a, a, a completed horse bow. Yeah. Same way with the other ones. I should be getting some limited numbers of rawhide strips in, but just consider this soft opening, just for wood. The the bow blank. Already tailored and everything. Number two, rounded. And in the case of like the horse bow, do you want me to steam shape it? Three different prices on everything. But yeah, if you can hang on until Saturday, you can start buying. That's excellent. All right. Well, thank you for watching. And I uh, hope I answered some of your questions because I keep getting how, where's your website? What's your eBay store? Um, this and that. And I had a fellow that wants, uh, not going to pick on him personally, his name. Wondered if I'd do a commission bow. Uh, a stave made native, native bow. You don't start to finish, complete one, and then send it to him. Yeah. Those are on the table, too. Well, the last thing. International shipping is horrible. The last time I shipped one of these things to England, a single bow... $220 to send one of these things to England now. It's, it's ridiculous. It's price shipping is just obnoxious. And so he wound up finding a friend, and they both received Finnish paddle bows, and it was $240. And this was some years ago in shipping, and they split the cost. But yeah, fortunately, you know, a little 48-incher, you know, probably would be not prohibitive, and also, of course, you know, 40, 
8 in Red Oak, you could probably get 46, 47 in Osage sinew bag, and you would get a pretty decent draw length out of it. And so those are some considerations. I apologize to my international friends, but shipping, you're going to be paying out the nose to get it from here to there. That is all. Thank you for watching.